of the love of Christ by John Bunyan. The love of Christ, poor I, may touch upon, but tis unsearchable, or there is none its large dimensions can comprehend, should we delayed their own world foot end. When he had sinned in a seal he swore, that he upon his back of sins would be, and since unto sin is entailed death, he vowed for his sins he'd lose his breath. He did not only slay or resolve, but to an astonishment did so involve himself in man's distress and misery as for, and with him both to live and die. To his eternal flame and sacred story, we find that he that lay aside his glory, stepped from the throne of highest dignity, became poor man, did in a manage a lie. Yea, was beholden unto his forbred head of his own, not where to lay his head. A rich, he did for us become us poor, that he might make us rich for evermore. No was this but the least of what he did, at the outset of what he suffered. God made his blessed son under the law, under the curse, which, like the lion's paw, it ran and tears so for mankind's sin, more than a thief for it in hell had been. His cries, his tears, and bloody agony, the nature of his death doth testify. Nor did he oft constrain himself for skiff, for sin to death that men might with him live. He did do what he did most willingly. He sung and gave God thanks that he must die. But to kings used to die for captive slaves, yet we were such when Jesus died to save. Yet when he made himself a sacrifice, it was that he might save his enemies. And though he was provoked to retract his blessed results for such as a good an act, the abuse of carriages of those that did both him his love and grace oppose. Yet he is unconcerned with such things, goes on, determines to make captives kings. Yet many of his murderers he takes into his favor and them princes makes.